celebrating six years in business. It is a new venture I have started because I've been doing this for a long time and uh, well, it seems like a long time trying to design things for our clients and I thought I would introduce a new venture to Plymouth clients all, all the country really uh, where I bring in the fabrics from Africa. They are vibrant, they are colorful and they make people happy. And I thought, you know, spread the happiness. As we said, we, we're trying to add color um, so we are calling it Glamour Icons Vibes. And my clientele for ball guns have actually increased this year. Uh, so we are lucky, in, I'm lucky enough to have a school just opposite to where I work. And the girls there always come here to have their dresses altered or have their own designs done. The website is basically for basic alterations. Uh, and with that, then the clients get to send the alterations instead of coming to the studio. So it's it's much easier trying to get clientele all over the, the nation instead of just Plymouth, kind of expanding my clientele. Initially, I was trying to get set up as a woman entrepreneur. That seems to, to be quite hard at times than trying to get the funding that you needed or the place. But I did have quite good friends that... Uh, own this uh, building and they started me with a smaller uh, place that I worked before uh, I set up before and I think it's all about sometimes who you know but you know having gone to networkings as well and speaking to other people as you get to know people in the business it becomes easier we've seen the wave of other cultures coming through to Plymouth uh, and that has helped us as business people, you know, somebody, people being re being able to relate to you and thinking, you know what, I'm influencing other people that they can actually do this. You don't have to be different to being an influencer in the business. The future is bright, hopefully conquer the world. I mean, I've been invited to some shows in Milan uh, to try and promote diversity with especially the fabrics when people know that I am actually creating these designs they are willing to you know put me out there uh, but as a small business I don't want to rush into so much I want to take my step and make sure that I am doing it right uh, but you know sky is the limit I just love what I do um, and I think if you have a passion for what you do and then you'll be successful.